Before getting started, I'm excited to partner with PayPal on this video. I had the privilege of attending PayPal's first ever developer day at their headquarters in San Jose, California last month. And it was my first time traveling to the United States. So I wanted to document my journey, experience, and what I learned from attending the event. Starting with my journey. It was a long flight from where I live in South Africa. But thanks to the power of editing, I can cut over 30 hours of travel into a quick 10 second montage of me boarding the plane, chatting with the pilot, boarding the second plane, landing in San Francisco, checking into my hotel, and finally getting some much needed sleep before the big day. And before I knew it, it was time for developer day. Day one. Arriving at PayPal's campus was insane. The buildings are massive and the grounds are absolutely beautiful. As I entered, we were greeted by the registration desk and the event volunteers, and everybody was so nice and helpful with check-in. The agenda was packed with two days of learning sessions and hands-on workshops. I started day one by meeting and chatting with the PayPal team outside the main event stage, and this was one of the main highlights of my trip. They are genuinely so nice and friendly. Before joining the keynote, I noticed they had an AI selfie photo booth that I had to try out. Now, I'm not one for selfies, but this was really a cool experience, even if the outcome didn't quite come out how I thought it would. Then came the keynote. It featured PayPal CEO Alex Chris, who shared more about what we could expect over the next two days and the future vision of PayPal. Good leadership is top down not bottom up. And Alex is inspiring and making good progress on his promise to making improvements to PayPal's tech. The PayPal team and culture are amazing. Making good products starts with the right people and that is what they have. So I'm looking forward to seeing how things progress this year and beyond. The first session of the day was all about introducing Fastlane. The chief of product, John Kim, shared a great overview with a lot of fascinating data on the economy and the payment industry as a whole. He outlined that with today's economy, the cost to acquire new customers has never been higher. So finding new ways to reduce friction at checkout is absolutely crucial. And that is where Fastlane comes in to help. And in my opinion, every business should be offering it to their customers. Look, the reality is most new products are just over hot, but Fastlane is here to stay. And it's not just some fluffy product. The data is showing crazy results, like some businesses are seeing shoppers with Fastlane profiles convert approximately 80% of the time. And Fastlane shoppers check out approximately 32% faster. It's quite remarkable, and it's still only the beginning. If you'd like to learn more about Fastlane, I've got a video about what it is and why you should use it Yeah, But back to Developer Day. After finishing that session, I had the pleasure of interviewing Billy Conway and Corin Posada, who head up Fastlane Engineering at PayPal. This was really a great conversation where we discussed more about Fastlane, the challenges they faced going into market, working at PayPal, and much more. If you'd like to hear the full interview, it's this podcast episode on the Freelance Podcast, and trust me, it's a good one. And then it was time for lunch. I ate in a courtyard patio under the trees, and this was such a cool spot. Very California zen. Now, before heading into the third session of the day, I had to make a quick, important pit stop at the candy bar. Session 3 was all about tools and resources for PayPal Complete Payments Integration. It covered how Fastlane works from a technical perspective and how to integrate it into your existing tech stack. At the first break of the day, I got to have a little fun, playing some games and shooting a hole in one. It was just what I needed before heading to the next session, which focused on the success stories of a few merchants who have integrated Fastlane. This was a good one because I got to hear from real life users of Fastlane and how it helped them increase their conversions on their website. Big shout out to Jordan Sim, VP of Big Commerce, who was part of this panel. I was able to chat with him one on one later, and he's really awesome. Now, after this session, came the time to put Fastlane into practice with hands on coding lab. There were three different coding events throughout the whole campus, which included a hackathon. They also had an area where we could chat with engineers and the people behind making Fastlane. I decided to sign up for a one on one session with a PayPal engineer for day two to get up close and personal with the Fastlane integration. After day one, Coding Labs ended, it was time to hit the courtyard for an end of day party wrap up. They had food vendors, a DJ, more games, and it was just a really cool place. Catch up and network with everyone. Day two. Our final day was all dedicated to hands-on coding labs so everyone could leave knowing how to work with Fastlane. I booked a one-on-one session with Omkar, who was very friendly 
now Paul. He showed me how the Fastlane integration works and gave me a walkthrough of the docs and a few other resources. If you'd like to find out more about the integration, watch this video I made here. Before I knew it, developer day was coming to an end. So I made another quick stop to the candy bar and started saying goodbye to everyone I met during an amazing two days. I was even able to fit in some San Francisco exploring and eating before starting my travels back home. I walked away from developer day learning a lot. But here are my three main takeaways. If you are a developer, I think it's a non-negotiable to integrate Fastlane into your client websites so that they can get better results. If you are a merchant and you want to increase your conversions plus improve your checkout UX, then I hope by now you can see that integrating Fastlane can help your business grow. The PayPal team is really committed to the developer experience. They are passionate about improving their products and they will continue to introduce innovations that will help both developers and merchants over the next few years. I'm really excited to see what they do next. And a quick honorable mention, if you're planning on visiting the US, make sure you go on a diet afterwards because there are way too many American salads to choose from. Thanks for watching and cheers for now.